Hello dear ladies and gentlemen, welcome to another benchmarking video where I'm placing Ubuntu 14.10 against Windows 7 in the game CSGO. So, it seems that all games are a bit strange when it comes to a triple screen. Uh, as you may have noticed in my last video on Left 4 Dead 2, uh, I didn't do a benchmark for the triple screen and I haven't done it with this game. Because they seem to have graphical glitches which, uh, yeah, it doesn't really work. But yeah, the driver versions are uh, for Linux it's 346.47 and for Windows it's 347.88. Uh, the, the Nvidia drivers. So CS:GO is a very good game. It's a very good port onto Linux as well. Um, but as you can see, it seems to be dipping a little bit in terms of frame rate. But you can't really seem to tell whilst you're in game. Uh, I got a nice bit of footage here as well from the start where I, I did pretty damn good, and um, so it's pretty nice to get that uh, onto a video. But as you can see, uh, Windows is consistently ahead of Linux, as you see right there, I sort of give a nod to my teammate for helping me there. <laughs> but um, yeah, it's constantly ahead, um, they're con both always above, uh, well it seems Windows is always above 200, uh, Windows uh, and Linux seems to be dipping down to about, uh, as you can see there, 188 right there. Um, so the, the Windows port is definitely a... A lot better. Well, I'd say a lot better, but a fair bit better than the Linux port. Uh, but even then, the Linux port is still running great. I mean, 180 frames per second—that is still brilliant. Um, uh, comparing it to Windows, uh, you know, it's not great, but still, we have CS:GO on Linux, so I, I guess we can't complain in that sense. But the frame rate is sort of a bit more turder than the Windows version. I mean. Linux very rarely even goes ahead of Windows, uh, and it seems that it's not even matching it at any point. But, yeah, I mean, like, I'd get a couple of nice little kills here. None of the headshots, which sort of suck, but, yeah. But, yeah, this marks my third benchmarking video, so, I mean, you guys can feel free to give me some constructive feedback. Uh, tell me what I'm doing wrong. Please tell me what I'm doing wrong. It would be great to hear what you think. Uh, you know, I started these because of Penguin Recordings. I loved his videos, and I, I spoke to him about it on one of his videos. Uh, I can't give him enough credit uh, because he sort of got me in, like motivated to do it without, in, you know, without that being his intention, so to say. But um, yeah, I, I love doing these benchmark videos. It's great to see how Linux compares to Windows at its current state. You know, we don't have DirectX; we use OpenGL. So there is a big difference in that case. I mean, I did use Unigine Engine, which used both, did use OpenGL on both operating systems. So it was, that was a nice sort of benchmark to do, because they were both very evenly matched, but Windows came out ahead. Um, but it'll be interesting to see uh, in the near future if I can find a game which performs consistently above Windows. Um, I expected Left 4 Dead 2 to perform much better, but it didn't. Uh, I mean, I, it, they did say, the developers, that it does perform a lot better. I'm not too sure whether it's my drivers or m my computer, but I mean, I've got a pretty decent computer. But uh, as you can see, it's constantly like 30, well, 30 to 60 FPS uh, below the, the Windows version, uh, as it's nearly 100 frames per second lower. But whilst it's in game, you don't really notice because it is running so smooth, you can't really tell that it's running bad. So, yeah, um, I mean, if, if you guys want to see me benchmark a certain game in the future, I'll certainly give it my best shot. Uh, Valve is a, a great game to test. Val Valve games are great to test because you can do these these demos, so you can try it on both operating systems, showing the exact same gameplay at the exact same second, which is great. Uh, certain games like Dying Light don't let you do that. But, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this uh, benchmark video. Uh, Linux didn't do that great this time, but oh well, it ran great anyway, so I hope you guys enjoyed this video, rate and subscribe for future Linux content, and peace out guys, see you later.